I am here in Wyoming, the home of strange animals like the jackalope. It originated here in Douglas, Wyoming. I, I don't really get it. They have a statue of it. It's a whole thing. Uh, another animal they really like here is the bison. It's even on their state flag. You can look at it. Uh, and for some reason, even though they like it so much, they also make burgers out of it. So I am here today to get the bison burger, which essentially is a hamburger, but instead of beef, they use bison meat. So uh, I'm really excited for that. So we're going to see where we can get one in the very boring and very long state of Wyoming. I'm going to eat you. Casper, Wyoming to obtain my bison burger after I obtained my bison earlier. Uh, and uh, we're going to go to a place called The Fort. It's cowboy themed. It's western expansion. Shout out to the Platte River. So as you can see, I am inside the fort. Uh, it's very interesting, pretty interesting restaurant, local Wyoming fair, and I'm here to eat a Rocky Mountain Oyster or a Bull Testicle. Uh, they're on the menu, and I thought it would be fun to eat and try, and as you can see, uh, my first bite is not terrible, surprisingly. Um, they were actually super good. I'd really recommend getting Bull Testicles. I mean, solid choice, 10 out of 10. So I am inside the fort. I have just enjoyed some fantastic bull testicles. I don't know why you're so averse towards the bull testicles. This is my father. Um, he did not want to eat a bull testicle. Uh, he said it was not fun. Uh, but we have the bison burger uh, here. As you can see, big old bison meat. And we are going to try this right now. Okay. Mm. Bison, I feel the beef has a sweeter but more flavorful taste. It's a, it's a fuller taste than the uh, ground beef. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Adds a layer. Very Wyoming in. As you can see by the Wyoming news in the background. Look at that. That's great. Look at Wyoming. Good for them. Um, it's good. It's good. This burger. particular burger has a nice big patty size. So, um, Although the patty to bun ratio, you know, yeah. bread to sandwich ratio is kind of messed up, not going to lie. But, you know, we don't mind that. It's going to be a meat and bun. This is like a Wendy situation. Yeah. Where's the beef? Well, where's the bison? The bison's right here. Yeah. Can't miss it. It's a tad excessive. Um, overall ranking, it's good. It's a good burger. I would get it. Um, is it my favorite thing ever? Uh, no, it's definitely not. Uh, it's definitely, definitely Wyoming, and it's on the flag as you saw, so. Yeah. I'd say uh, it's a bison. It begins with a B. I would say B. You put B, I would say this is A. A, all right, go A with this. This would go, go A ahead. because it's a thing I would order. Uh, but, you know, it's not S tier. This is I, not. I've actually ordered it before in this restaurant, so yeah, I would have to say it's A. Yep, there we go. A tier sandwich. Goodbye, Wyoming. You're kind of boring, not gonna lie. There's a reason Dick Cheney isn't called Richard.